today we're going to have a little bit of a casual chat. We're going to change things up just a little bit. And we've selected some of the LPGA's finest, and then Tiffany Joe, because there was no one else <laughs> around. That was it. We're scraping the barrel, and she was there. So we're going to have a little chat today about some of the items on the agenda for the LPGA this year, and just you know, talk over some of the issues, a couple of the rules you want to change. So three minutes, go on the clock now. One of you can create the buzzer at the end if you want. I don't know how good you are at sound effects, but we'll see how things go. I'm looking this way, deliberately not that way. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, she's got no musical instruments, so we're okay. But item number one on the agenda th today is rules. What rule would you love to see changed in golf? I mean, I'm a big fan of speeding up pace of play, so I feel like... I mean, I feel like there should be a shot clock <laughs> and maybe some type of penalty for going over it. Not like, I'm not talking about fines or stroke penalties. I think it should be more physical. Okay. Like so maybe more you like just a... get socked in the face. <laughs> okay. Like if you go two seconds over time, you just get hit. Or I don't know, maybe like a slime bath. This I'm a is, big fan of it. This is good. The slime bath is, is a, a way to, it's a good starting point yeah. at the very least. Might be not so good if you've got to carry the slime each week. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't think trouble. that one through. Yeah. <laughs> the shame bell on your phone, though. That'll, that'll come out. Shame. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Madeline? That's true. Um, I would say that, I mean, pitch marks and ball, like not just pit, like yeah, spike, spike marks on greens. Yes. Those just. You had a bad one. Well, not a bad well, one, a bad, but interesting yeah, one last one, week, didn't you? Um, I had one in Korea off the green. Um, I was off. I hit. I hit my ball on the green, and I had my mark off the green. I was thought, okay, maybe it makes sense that I could fix it because I'm on the green. And we, we, like something didn't feel right, calling the rules, and then it all came down to the order of play, and if it was already there, and I was like, this is so complicated. <laughs> I mean, it goes into place of play, though. I mean, like I have to call the rules every time I'm like thinking yeah. about it. So it was like, it just became a big. Deal. I mean, it's a thick rule book as well. Sometimes, like, is that something oh, maybe yeah, like more pictures, like the <laughs> <laughs> maybe like a cartoon? Okay, we video. could sit everyone down and show them a cartoon whenever they start. Rules golf. and yeah. gifts. <laughs> Rules and gifts. Yeah. We're on to something, Nicole. I would say rule, rule hitting book? like a perfect drive in the fairway and being in a divot is so annoying. Like, it's the worst. I know it's like, it's hard to say if it's a new one or how old it is and like there might be some old ones that's not that big but just coming up to a ball, laying in a divot is... That's why I try to never hit perfect drives. <laughs> <laughs> so it might be in a divot, so... The key is to be off the, the fairway. The key is to always <laughs> miss the fairway. You can learn a lot from me. <laughs> Alright, well I think we've smashed agenda point number one. Stop the clock. I think we're ahead of time. We are. Ooh. Gold. <laughs> No. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs>